So somebody recently asked, how do you do manual bed leveling when you have a BL touch or similar measurement probe installed on your Neptune 2? And the short answer to that is I don't really know because I'm not running stock firmware. But in my case, what I would do is, knowing that I have a fixed reference point for my Z offset between the BL touch and the nozzle, wherever this table is going to fall in outer space, the BL touch is going to tear against that table surface and set that as zero. So it doesn't really matter where it is height-wise. It's just a matter of are the four corners close enough to be in level. So what I do is I take a block. I have this block here. And it doesn't have to be a precision ground block. It could just be a printed artifact of, of some reasonable parallelism. And the easiest way to do this is to just bring your table wheels down just a little bit. Drop your table down a little bit. Bring the block near the nozzle. Bring the Z down until it's just slightly above the block. So where you could slide it underneath freely. Maybe the thickness of a piece of paper or something like that. And then what you do is you'll crank your first wheel and get it to where you get a nice little friction fit. And then what I do is in the Marlin firmware, I just say off XY to kill the X and Y motors, but keep the Z stationary. So from that point, what I can do is I can just take the the head of the nozzle here, put it in this corner, put the block, do the same thing, screw, 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 until I feel a friction fit, grab the table, pull it forward, put the block here, and then bring the nozzle over, and do it here. And once you have those four points set, the table's going to be level or flat relative to the four points with the X and Y axis. And then you can run your auto bed level. And again, you don't have to worry so much about your Z offset because your Z offset is coming relative to the BL touch in relation to the nozzle. So I hope that was helpful. Thank you for watching. We'll see you soon.